Hello, everyone. This is Film Story. Today, I'll be talking about Black Magic Pocket Cinema Camera. Original, not 4K or 6K. The original. All right, here is my BMPCC original. Not sponsored by Black Magic, unfortunately. I bought this camera about four or five months ago, uh, second hand, for about 400,000 Korean won.、Uh, that is roughly about 350 US dollars. The original owner kept it really well and he made awesome customizations. For example, it came with the cage and the power bank mount, and it was originally a full cage. But he cut it in half to get a better grip. And as you might know already, the battery for BMPCC sucks. Luckily, the previous owner made a customized cable for himself. He took a、uh, 12 volt cable and cut the other end and soldered with the USB C cable so it can receive the power from the power bank. In terms of the power bank, you must use a、uh, USB PD battery. Otherwise, a BMPCC will not recognize it. One thing you need to be careful of is that you must plug in the power after turning the camera on. If you turn it on while it is plugged into the power bank, it won't recognize it. The camera will not even turn on if the power is plugged in. It's something you need to be aware of. For audio,、uh, I don't really use the internal microphone because it sucks. So, if I really need the audio, I use the、uh, Zoom H1, like this. But you should remember to plug this into the、uh, headphone line out, not、uh, into the microphone in. I don't know why, but it's the other way around. And for the lenses, I mainly use.、Uh, Famous Sigma 18-35 EF lens with the Filtrox、uh, speed booster. It's great for low light situations and is heavy, which makes it perfect for handheld shooting because it doesn't have the IS built in it. Other lenses I use are Canon EF 24-105 F4. Even though it's F4,、uh, it is still, I think, good for outdoor shooting. During the day, for run and gun situations, especially because it has a built in image stabilization and it works great on the BMPCC. The aperture goes down to 2.8, but I highly recommend not to go wide open because it becomes blurry. Well, I guess that's it for me today. I hope this video helped you in a meaningful way. And remember, you are a great storyteller. The best camera is the one you have in your hand. Thank you very much, and I'll see you again.